Well, I really have to be the one to say it. I'll say it. Every four years, we go through the same mess where somebody's promising something, and we all know that it's nothing more than policies, nothing more for them to be in power. But at the end of the day, it's not Kamala Harris, it's not Donald Trump that's going to save us. We have to save ourselves. And the most disrespectful, disrespectful, foolish reality is that we prove we have the power, but we don't want to do anything. Let me show you how. Did you not hear that within 24 hours, black women came together and organized and raised millions of dollars? Which means, here's the sad point, we could have been fixed our communities, we could have been organized and fixed the educational problems we have, we could have been fixed the challenges going on with different groups of people, but the problem is we rather put our money behind a hope and a dream versus something that actually can be changed. You're telling me we can raise $300 million in a short amount of time and we can't empower our local nonprofits and community organizations to take care of our local groups, our county groups, our state groups, our national issues? We have the power, but we rather keep putting it behind people to give us the same lies every four years. We go through this every four years. And our, we don't learn. It just shows that education in this country is not valuable at all because we constantly keep going through the same twists and turns every four years. It's the same issue. But we keep proving we got the resources, we got the brilliance, we have the education, but we don't have the willingness to actually do the work. Every four years, it's the same 